I, I still think the 80s and 90s were like the best era to live in and grow up in. Yeah. I know, right? <laughs> no, of course, no. 2000s were, were no, no, no. The two, come on. The 80s. The, I'm an 80s baby. The 2000s. The 80s. This is like the resurgence. Okay, it's a new, little one. Okay. A new century. <laughs> no. Bro. The like honestly, it's, it's like it's like a legit like a renaissance. No, it's y'all y'all are doing it? stuff that the we 2000s. did. I, that's just repeated stuff. Well, the eighties repeated stuff then. No, the eighties yes. were original. Mm-hmm. There's nothing original about two thousands. The internet. Nothing. The internet. No. No. Okay, I'll give you that. <laughs> like style, the internet. A style, no, no, no. Two thousand no. stuff. Yes. That is repeat from the eighties and nineties. No. Let's. You two thousand style. Pull up, pull up. Everything is. You talking about you know the bye 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 people in sync and all of them, all the boy bands. Style. Okay, you see Destiny's Child back in the day. This is like. Okay, style. now pull up the let's say maybe 1980s. the the nineties. I'm gonna Probably say 1980s. more nineties. No, I think it was Did Look at. Oh, look at look at them over there. See, same okay, same but, yeah, styles. You, you can, you can find inspiration. Mm. It's like saying like there's no original music. Yes, there is. It's just yeah, people it's, take people take inspiration from things and that makes it new. Oh. It's in, the eighties oh. didn't just the eighties didn't just come out of nowhere. It didn't, but it's been carbon copied now. Cause all that what, fashion what? just recycles. The bell bottoms from the seventies came back when I was around your do you age. Think, do you well, think... a little younger when I was in high school. And now they're back again. Okay. It just recycles. So, okay, so you're saying there's nothing was recycled from the 80s, it was all new? No, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying now, in our lifetime, we're seeing it repeated now. But, so, you, but you started out by saying the 2000s. No, is I, like, I said 80s. 80s and 90s no, are pretty much original. 70s and 90s. And also the 2000s. With also inspiration. No, no, no. With also inspiration from other things. I'm not going to deny that. Because, like, you're re- killing what? me. No, legit. <laughs> I can't. I'm not. Okay. I'm no. not co-signing now. Not, not. Yes, I'm over thirty. I'm thirty-eight. About to be forty. <laughs> she just so, skipped thirty-nine. I'm just. So, <laughs> I'm thirty-eight. About to be forty. Nothing was original. A two thousand. You think it's just like carbon copy from like the eighties and nineties? So okay. The from what I remember, the two in two thousand, I was in high school. Mm-hmm. So that's when the boy bands were, you know, really big. R and B was big. Um, that era for me, I felt was new original stuff, but it really wasn't because I remember wearing my mom's clothes from when she was in the eighties. Well, doesn't mean doesn't mean. That's, so that means was, you were behind. That doesn't mean the time. Shut up. That means, that <laughs> no, mean that, yeah, yeah. No, I'm saying those trends and fashions that she had, the plastic purses and the the big wide jeans, like the baggy jeans, like all of that was just recycled fashion that came into the 2000s. But it still spun crop, into something new, right? Not really, yeah. because Re- Aaliyah was then, she was really popular, how I used to wear my hair swooped to the side and... I had the tight shirt and then I had the baggy pants. Like that's repeated from what they did in the 70s and 80s and the 90s. The 2000s was just copy. I, I think I think you're <laughs> saying. Little... I, I think you're. It's, it, it wasn't copy. It wasn't a blatant copy. There's no way. There's no way. Because again, what's original? What? what oh okay, yeah, hold up. It's like us living now, and it being a new year. What changed? Would change from December thirty first to January first. Nothing, nothing. That's how it felt when you're in it. You're like, oh, nothing really changed. Also, but like, we you didn't take a step back and actually look of what two thousand is. Like, like I said, the internet, the style. Okay, the, y'all, the way I people the talk. How did y'all talk different? Well, I, don't know, I was like two, but oh. I'm saying like I was saying like <laughs> language or like the way like um, the style, the inflection of like your voice and language changed. I mean, yeah, we're not 2000s. saying like back in the, I mean, in the 2000s, I probably, we were talking like, dude, that whatever we would say, that is different, but it's still carbon copy because it's stuff that we did Ca- before. Carbon copy means... The same exact thing. But it's not, it's not carbon copy from the 80s or 90s. No. Man, it, that stuff is. Again, if, if you're going to use, if you're going to use that, if you're going to use that argument, then the 80s copied something. It probably did, but I wasn't born in that lifetime. What would the 80s be a reflection of? 
what would you think? What era? Nothing, right? It's kind of you. You go from the Roaring Twenties, then you have the Fifties and Sixties was like the flapper dancers, and the Sixties was mainly hippie stuff, Seventies hippie stuff, Eighties was the how would you describe the eighties? Hip hop color blocking, big shoulder Madonna stuff. I'm still pretty sure in that time span between like the fifties and like the nineties, there was some overlap. It wasn't it had just to be a little bit, but it there was probably a lot of overlap. But, but that it was just, like origination was back then. I, I think once you got to two thousands, it was all carbon copy. No, <laughs> they it, ran out of ideas. Carbon copy? No, that's that's no. Well, tell me something that's original besides the internet that's from the 2000s. Because, again, like I say, I was in it, so it's kind of hard to well, be Well, like, um, I, I could say music, but, again, you can just say, oh, they Boy band stuff? That was original. Yeah, like, that was, yeah, like, yeah that was boy big. bands. Um, Britney Spears? Yeah, the style of pop, the style of rap, like, that's new. Okay. It was like... Hip-hop. And, of course, you have to start nice. somewhere so that they knew how to rap, how to sing, how to do this, how to dress... But it's their own spin. I'm not even denying that it's like taking inspiration from something else. Mm. But it's still new. I, I'm gonna give you that one. Yeah. But so I'm like, it's, it's not a carbon copy. And I don't even, yeah. I would give you that one. I still feel that the 2000s was a lot of. It had original things because the boy bands were big back then. Mm-hmm. Britney Spears, Christina iPods, Aguilera. iPods, Apple. Ooh, yeah, yeah there you go. I yeah, iPad, iPads came out. Steve Jobs and all that stuff. But it's it's kind of like by the time we got to the year two thousand, fashion and stuff was repeating itself. Like, I'm not saying there's not new fashion. Mm-hmm. There's not new music, but it's kind of like people were sampling a lot more. It went from more computer single high pitch beats to mumble rap very quickly. It's just kind of now people are just. So you're thinking more of the 2010s than like the actual early 2000s? Yeah, early 2000s was mainly boy bands, Christina. Yeah, like I'm not talking about like 2010s and on. I can give you that because the. Is that when Drake came out? Yeah, like 08, See, something like that. Once yeah. Pound Cake dropped, it kind of was... Oh, Pound Cake? I think Pound Cake came out uh, like 2007. 13. Oh, 13? Pound, Pound Cake? Yeah. You're talking about the one with... Um, Pound Cake with his face? The, yeah. With the sky? Yeah, that's... Um, Maybe it's, I'm going to say it's 12 or 13. I'm about to Google. But, um... So I can give you that, like, the use of, like, nostalgia and vintage. Mm-hmm. That's in style now. So I'll give you that, like, 2010s, on, especially 2020s. That's like really popular. That's the word I was looking for. Like it was 2010s. Yeah, 2013. but it's like, yeah, 13. Yeah. So, yeah, there you go. But I'm talking about early 2000s where things were actually new. Yeah, the boy bands. <laughs> <laughs> the boy bands and the Britney Spears. And I'm a huge Britney fan. I have the Britney doll. Okay. I, mm-hmm. I love the 2000s. Again, that's when I was in high school. But I just still feel like I look at what. Our cousin, my little cousins, are wearing and doing now, and I'm like, that's the same thing I was wearing. Well, I still dress like that. I wonder now. if <laughs> I wonder if I would say that when I'm like 40. It's like probably. Oh, Maybe. you're just copying the 2000s. This was the best era, cause yeah, <gasps> I feel yeah. like I can say that if I'm 40. But I'm serious. The 80s then, were the then, best. <laughs> then, then, then I can use like I can have the 80s. Um, I don't know what do you call it. Pride. For the 2000s. You can. But it's still, then those kids need the argument on me. Like, yeah, you that's what that. happened. Then it's like, then there's it nothing just, original. So that's why I'm saying. Listen. Those kids back then or it's a debate. in the future, when I'm 40, will say, no, it's not. I was like, we just like, yeah. Yeah, they're going to, sh- were we talking about this? How they're going to be looking at, we're going to be telling them about YouTube. Oh, me, your brother. We were talking about it. And I was like, uh, our kids are going to grow up and be like, look at this new system i'm like yeah i remember back in the day we did youtube they're gonna be like youtube what's yeah. that like <laughs> uh-huh. you know here we are thinking it's something new but no you're right a hundred percent i could argue 80s and 90s was the best because i grew up in it and that's what it is you could say the same thing about mm-hmm. the 2000s but that's the joy of it well okay i'm not saying at- it, i'm not saying it's the best i'm saying what's the well, no, i can't i can't I, I, <laughs> I have to but but um I'm going to defend it and say it was, like, not just a carbon copy and there was a lot of er- 
carbon copy. You know what carbon copy yeah, means? It means copy is. paste. They did copy no. paste. All them boy bands was doing the same thing. Bye bye bye. Like that's like come on. Carbon copy from the eighties. Um, Bobby Brown and them. What's some other boy bands from back in the eighties and nineties? Uh, Boys to Men. Like that's nothing new. Like that's all. And they you take the, a and formula. They, and they copied that from. The Think of K-pop. So like you take. 20 boys or 20 girls or 10 girls you make a band you make a song you put it out they go on tour you market it same thing that diddy did or he may go by p diddy i don't know what he goes by now um he did a girl band and a boy band he did the same thing it's a formula you take the formula you carbon they copy that with <laughs> yeah like destiny's child is a formula it's carbon copy y'all it's nothing new you put your little spin on it boom you make it original, but you still. That's what I'm take saying. The '80s pieces. was nothing new. Yes, it was. No, <laughs> it's a spin on what the '50s laid out in the okay, '40s. Okay, and it so, probably goes go. back to when they was having, whenever music started. Yeah. When did music start like that? <laughs> really? What was the first album? Beethoven or something? <laughs> <laughs> the first album. <laughs> what was the first album? Thirty-five thousand years ago. Wow. I'm going to learn music first. Period. And to think, I'm over here complaining about 38. And that's 35,000. I don't know anything. We don't know anything. Who dropped the first album? <laughs> you didn't mean the first, that. You didn't mean I, that. I, I, I meant that. He said, no, I did mean that. I'm, I'm going to start from square one and try to get to where Tyler came in. Wish me luck. I'm going to go all the way from this to the 2000s, okay? Wish me luck. I'm going to do all that research. See where we came from square one to where Tyler came, all right? Tyler, the creator? Yeah, Tyler, the creator. So I'm going to do all that research of, yeah, yeah. So, okay. I'm, I'm going to see, I'm I'm see what music gets good. If we're basing it, you should have just said that. If we're basing it on Tyler, the creator, no, I'm, I'm, or I'm, Childish Gambino, I would have been like, yeah, that's the best generation music right there. But you didn't say that. <laughs> you just said nah. 2000. So I'm thinking. Well, I'm not talking bands. about, I'm not talking about 2010s. If I was, then I would bring up Tyler Kendrick. Oh, okay, yeah, because that's all I care about. I'm still thinking of, like, and, yeah, that's why there's a still a lot of things recycled from 90s, because, like, 2000 is so close. Like, we still play with 90s stuff and watch 90s cartoons. I couldn't agree with that. But, again, the new stuff, the new animation style, the new music, yeah. the new media, yeah, how things new. are, it's just, yeah. Because technology progressed, so that's mm -hmm. one thing that ties back into one of our first questions. But, I mean... In the 2000s, Kanye dropped. Like, I'm thinking, like, okay, you have some really good points here, but the 80s and 90s are still the best. Okay, yeah, we're just like, <laughs> you it's had just... Janet Jackson, you had Whitney Houston, you had Madonna, like, you just had a plethora Wham. of just. You remember Wham? Wham, you listen, you, new edition, like, Tears come on. <laughs> The it was so much good music. Now, no offense again, and I have a 19-year-old, so I remember some of his music, and he would be like, Mom, look out. Boy, what is they saying? And I'm young, so I'm like, nah. Let me mm -hmm. <laughs> let me introduce you to Erica Badu and some stuff, but it's just not the same. <laughs> it's just, it's just, I just part of growing up, we have to like, agree to disagree. Because, like, okay, we can it's just, it. it's literally... Oh yeah, somebody said we had VHSs. Man, for real. Yeah, so I'm like, we still did 90s things. In the 2000s? Yeah. You had a VHS? We still, we, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, I don't know. We still watched DVDs. 90s cartoons, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's so I'm like, Saturday morning cartoons. Yeah, things were still passed down, but... I heard they don't even me. have that channel on cable anymore. You have to pay extra for the Cartoon what? Network. Cartoon Network? That's what I heard. I think it's always been... Like, no. It depends on what package. Yeah, it depends on what oh, package. Wow, that's crazy. It should be included. Because actually, Cartoon Network was usually on regular cable. It was like regular, like satellite cable. It was like Disney, Cartoon Network, and Nick. Mm -hmm. Disney sometimes mm -hmm. wasn't there, but it was like Nick. But it was like Cartoon Network was 22. Nick was like 45. The fact Disney, that she could and, remember and, and, and Disney was like 41 or 42. Yeah, you in know. case we yeah. ever need. In case we ever what about need. about Boomerang? Boomerang, that was like 20, 23 or 24, yeah. Man, I just remember the TV remember guide the guide would come and then you oh, would man. see. I tried to explain to Wait, them what? what the TV you guide would, get would like do a, for your life. It would, it would be a book 
that would come every once a week or something. I think, in, I think in we the had. Sunday. And it had a spreadsheet of yep. the time and the channel, and it would show you what time. It's like your what guide you, on mm-hmm. the TV, but it was on mm-hmm. paper. It was on paper, yeah. And back then, you could not yes. record <laughs> and come mm-hmm. back later. It was, if you don't yeah. sit here, and then we had commercials. Yes. Like, I'm, I'm bougie, so, like, you know, Netflix, I don't do the commercials. YouTube, I don't do mm-hmm. the commercials. Back then... Commercial, yeah, that was your best friend. Yeah. You'd be singing the commercials. Actually, like, yeah, commercials back then, they were actually good. But imagine having yeah. to look and see and what time. Your whole and then videos, when they would drop on MTV, BET, Uncut, at night when you're supposed to be asleep, but you was that's the bad videos that would come on at night. Mm-hmm. I would sneak to watch uh, adult those. Adult Swim. Right? <laughs> that's when you know it's time to go to bed. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. But I remember if we would have to be in front of the TV to catch the world premiere of the video. It was uh-huh. no go home and YouTube or yeah. watch it on your phone. It was none of that. Uh-huh. Artists didn't have that ability. Now artists are able to, like Beyonce, drop their own whole album by just by pushing a button. Yeah. And Drake keep playing with us and trying to tell us when his new album drop. Like it's things like uh-huh. that. We have more access to the artists. But I still say the '80s and '90s. Was <laughs> Mm-hmm. All, all, all that to say, yeah. Yeah, all that to say. But do you, what do you use? Like, what music? Um, Amazon Music, because not because I want to. Someone gave us an Alexa for Christmas like five years ago, and that just became mm-hmm. a part of. I was gonna ask, music. did does Amazon have um, a yearly wrap? What's that? Like, oh like, yeah, your does year Amazon review? have that? What, what's yours? Uh, uh, wait. So, are you mean like my? List? Yeah, like what is your your top five most played artists? From Amazon Music. Okay, let me see how I do that. <laughs> My year in review. Yeah, like who's your like top five artists? We go, we go back. My year in review. Oh, I don't. Where is it? I'm trying to find like the the list. Oh, I don't think I have that on here. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, that's fine. Okay. But but I don't know if that's in order of. It just says. I think I think from the top it's like your most played probably. Oh okay, so my. First song, remember y'all, I'm 38, so I ain't mm-hmm. listen to all that mumble stuff. Um, Macy Gray, Do Something, My Life by Mary J. Um, there's another song, I, I can't pronounce this song, but it's a song in Spanish that I use when I do my Reiki. But which one? This one. This one. It's about a little green <laughs> plant. <laughs> so anyway, that's mm-hmm, that okay. one. And then Rhythm Nation by Janet Jackson. One, two, three, four. Yep, that's my top five. And then it goes down into like really cool stuff. Do you know Tank and the Bangers? Hmm? Oh, wow. Okay. Tank and the Bangers. No. My list, my top five artists, with all this mumble knocking. Mm. It's Playboy Cardi. Just number one. Right. Destroy Lonely. Two. Let me see. Yeet is three. Yeet? I do like that song. Drake is four. And Lil Uzi is five. Yeet? I'm surprised too, actually. I'm not saying I'm disappointed. But and the 80s and 90s was the best. I know. I'm, yeah, I'm just saying, like, um, number one played song on Spotify was the Yeet song, Out the Way. Number two, Rockstar made Playboy Cardi. Number three, Old Money, Playboy Cardi. Number four, Bam Bam Thumb, Playboy Cardi. And number five, If Looks Get Killed, Destroy Lonely. So I would say your list to me makes me feel old. Yeah. <laughs> and this is like, I'm not even mad at this. Like, me back then would be like, oh, I, don't, well, I, need, I need... Earlier this year? No, like, yeah, maybe a year ago or two years ago, like, oh, there's no Kendrick, there's no Tyler. Yeah, I'm like, this is that, that mainstream. But it was intentional because I used this a lot in the gym. Mm, so you <laughs> need then, a different yeah, style of music. So I okay, played that, that makes the sense. Yeets and the Car- well, Cardi would probably be up there, but like a lot of that stuff because it's like gym music. Yeah, and I have 38, over 38,000 <laughs> minutes of listening time. I wish Amazon Music did that, but they don't. But again, I got swindled into whoever owned Jeff Bezos. Yeah, Bezos. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Amazon, <laughs> I'm yeah. like, you know, Alexa controls everything, and it's kind of just like, mm-hmm. but yeah. But I, I Spotify, yeah. they have commercials. Mm-hmm. I don't like that. 
And I'm not paying an extra. That's the thing. Yeah, stuff. it's either commercials or paying. I can't do mm-hmm. commercials, man. I mean, I'm a '90s child, but <laughs> it's like when it's it's I don't know, it's weird now. I think we're more impatient now. Very, uh, because that's what technology does to us. It makes us yeah instant gratification. That's mm-hmm. what's wrong with half of anybody under the age of 99. We want things now. <laughs> but yeah, but I brought up the list just to show like the difference between like yeah, that just yeah. showed my age. My list. <laughs> yeah. My to show my current. Like, I'm, I was really current this year. Because, like, I could be, like, in a, like, an elitist. Like, almost, again, it's not lyrical. It's not this, yeah. not that. That's how I was. But, like, I'm like, you know what? I don't care if it's heat. I'll just put it on because it sounds good. Like, I'm. You had I'm, that I'm, one I'm, go-to song. I'm, I'm in that where it's like, I don't care. Like, yeah, it's bad. But I'm like, okay, whatever. Yeah, it has a good hook. Yeah, it's got like, a good beat. Like, like yeah. I, I understand. I can understand way more of like what the kids like now. Like, it's like think I'll ever understand what because I'm like <laughs> this song is bad, but like okay, I get it. Like, um, who am I? Like Taylor Let's Swift. I don't like Taylor Swift, but I get it. Let's not even get on her. Don't sound. Let's just skip on cash. It was a, okay, but I'm saying friend. like, and like, mm, let me see who else. I can't think. Somebody, no, let's get on I, Taylor Swift real quick because I can't hold it. I just no, gotta take okay, it to my okay, what, okay, let's say so about listen, that I Beyonce had the greatest album of all time, but Taylor Swift again, I really feel like she's very talented. She writes about her life, she writes about her relationships, and that's beautiful. But at the same time, she's thirty something years old and she's singing about like high school stuff. So to me, it just I don't know, it's, it's. I don't want to use the word weird because I'm weird at times. Mm-hmm. It's just, she has the formula to what sells records. But if, uh, uh, let's take it out, um, an artist like uh, Normandy, she's the same pop star artist. She's a, a young black woman. She's not given the same marketing formula to expand her career as Taylor Swift. Because Taylor Swift is more palatable, and that bothers me. Mm-hmm. Because Normandy is just as talented, but because she's a little black girl, she's not as. Palatable. I'm not sure if that's a I'm, racial. Yeah, I'm not sure. If that, I'm, I'm not sure that's a racial like, thing, but yeah, I'm just you can say the same like, thing for Drake also. Yeah, Drake is 40 and he has the same formula. Well, at least as of late, he hasn't changed. He's anything. 40. Yeah, I think he's we're like 30. Hey, what's your? <laughs> <I'm, laughs> wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Now listen. But all I'm saying is you're mature. He doesn't act mature. No, I'm not immature at all. <laughs> Man, that's crazy. Oh, he's, he's 37. Oh, okay, we're just saying. You know, he just bought a 40 acre farm in Houston. Yeah. Uh huh. He loves Houston. He likes them chicken wings and the strippers. Mm, yeah. That's what he like. Yeah. Yeah, but I just feel like not that it's racist. It's just Taylor Swift is. Put on this pedestal because again she's just more palatable she's gonna sell more records she looks like what we've been brainwashed to think mm-hmm. beauty music standard is but you have other talented people you know beyonce sang about it brown skin girl like we're just as good too and don't think beyonce don't know that because of how she looks america accepts her a little bit easier too because she talks about how kelly who was in Destiny's Child struggled as an artist independently as well. So I'm just saying, I like Taylor Swift. I be singing some of her songs. I like Katy Perry. I'm a huge Britney Spears fan. Huge, huge. <laughs> Do you understand? I understand why that lady shaved her head off. Like me <laughs> hard. Like, <laughs> I love me some Britney. I'ma yeah. stand behind Britney, even when she was doing them crazy. I was right with her. Okay, mm. but I just feel like Taylor Swift is just. She's cracked the code, and I'm yeah. I'm a little upset. But I again, I still understand why. Mm-hmm. As I'm like, I, I understand why. I don't have to like it. Yeah, we but did. I it. understand. But I, I, I can't be like y'all and be like this. They need to show the same grace that they showed to Ty- Taylor Swift when she be breaking up with all these boys to Britney Spears. Just that's all I'm saying. She ain't hurt nobody dancing. In wait, wait. You said the grace. Show grace. So like Taylor Swift can break up with all these boys and. 
Oh, right and, and, and no one cares. Yeah, no one cares. Britney Spears, she kind of losing her mind, but yeah. she's using Instagram to dance and clear yeah. her mind and be creative, and everybody's coming at her. I'm like... I think it's because Taylor Swift doesn't do antics. That's, right. that's why. What do you mean? Like, she'll break it with a thousand people, but you kind of won't know about it, or she won't do the little dances. <laughs> Britney Spears will dance, and you'll know, and so people will now have a reason to comment. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Mm-hmm. There's no reason to comment unless you're obsessed about Taylor Swift. Good or bad obsessed. Man, I'm just saying, between Britney Spears and Beyonce, I'm a ride or die, but they didn't mm-hmm. leave Britney alone. She be going through stuff. She mm-hmm. just trying to heal. <laughs> but yeah. I'll say 2000s is better. Oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Randomly just 80s uh, and 90s are the best. I say all that to say. <laughs> But did did we find out when the first album really came out? Because I really would like to know that. So the first album, like, or the first song, because I know in the well, again, again, that goes back to legit history, like all five billion BC. Yeah. Oh, then no. I guess I'm trying to figure out maybe when the Billboard started or something, because it's something where we could be like, okay, this was the first record company or something, or I don't know people playing on a banjo it's something l what do you mean l i could i guess i could be basic and say ah, wait, a like, ah. wait you didn't even hear the two you didn't hear steven you i don't think you're gonna hear the entire time steven no doesn't matter no he is was, that the one that didn't like women in the yeah. beginning <laughs> but he, he didn't even listen to like the me he, le- oh. he listened you lost mm, i need anyway. to screenshot that look <laughs> go take a picture soon lost okay okay it's okay cousin we can do this all the time. Can I can I zoom in or? Yeah, <laughs> you can. It take might a be a regular orbiter. stream orbiter. Yeah, let me see. Wait, take it. I want to see me too. Oh. Got it. <laughs> I won the debate, and he didn't even like me in the beginning. You see how? <laughs> but you didn't win energy? anything. You didn't win anything. I won. It's say right there. Vote. You're gonna listen to him. He has a clown profile pic. This is wrong. No. Yeah. Okay, yeah, okay. No, nah, but when I when I go to Thailand or wherever I'm at, I'll um What's the time zone difference? Twelve hours. So like, so like right now it's, it's eleven thirty four AM. So if I were to call you right now, you're in Thailand, what time oh, would that be for you? Eleven thirty four AM. Oh, AM. That'd be Fine. Mm-hmm. You you'd be good at like it. Like, well say, I'll, I would finish training around yeah, I'll be done with training by this time. So, like, mm-hmm. I have training from 5.30 until 9.30, and then I don't have it again until 3. Okay. Why? Let me ask some good, like, time difference. Like, if I'm up, you're like, oh, I'm asleep. Oh, I'm up, I'm asleep. No, or I'm I, like, that's so I'm like, yeah. Do you usually stream at night? Yeah. <laughs> like, this is like, like, when I started, I started it almost says- five hours ago. So, I started. So, I was, yeah. This is a full time job. Yeah, but it, but again, it's not a job. It's, it's that's fun. right. It's, it's fun. Yeah, that's yeah. right. That's right. right. I it's think like, what you're doing is amazing. Uh-huh. Like when I see stuff like this, again, I'm not that much older than you, but since I am like a mom and all this other stuff, you know, I kind of had to grow up a little faster. Mm-hmm. But to when I see people do this, it's so amazing. How first of all, to be a content creator, to keep up with the technology, to just have that innate ability to do it and not be scared mm-hmm. you're you're amazing like i don't think you give yourself enough credit i so. probably don't yeah even though you lost the debate i didn't <laughs> lose oh wait wait actually do you have do you have anything else to add or like because no. since you were on the debate team so listen know, thomas you, freeman is like oh college like, I don't debate know. person over here but you can even look up like oh debate topics if you want you really trying to go at it? We can, yeah. If you, if you want, if you want to lose, let me let me. Okay, go ahead. Something. And you 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 can feed me. I'm yeah. gonna I'm gonna ask you the question. Cause I I threw you all the questions, so yeah. Yeah, let's let me find some. Incoming tune, L coming. Oh, no, no. <laughs> okay, no, we'll see, we'll see. If I do, I'll admit it. 